motherland be motherland 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 be hi honey makers how y'all doing how y'all doing it's about what time is it like 7 30 in the morning i'm on set woke up at like woke up at 5 10 yeah to be traffic back on set back on rhythm city i'll show you guys when it plays i just realized that i've gained so much weight guys this holiday season was a mess it was a complete mess so i need to get myself together what is that spot anyways yeah i'm on set we're going to go on well I'm, I'm at the studio we're going to go on set and have gain weight yeah that's all i wanted to tell you okay later okay i'm done with my scene Just taking this hair out because it's so painful sorry <laughs> it's so painful but guys yeah New hair, who dis? Ah, yes. I'm so tired. I need to lose weight. Like, wow, the festive season was such a disaster. I'm walking up the stairs and I'm like, <laughs> how disgusting is that? In two ways, I've got things to do. So, I'll maybe take a few pics, you know, because you know, new hair. It's so painful, guys. Because I've had dreadlocks for years, I never actually had. You know that pinch um, when you get braids done but after some time it'll be fine okay my sister lent me her car because I need a car isn't she awesome isn't she awesome anyway let me hit the road Jackie I'll see you guys later gotta wipe off the face you can you cannot keep TV makeup on for too long because the pimple situation will be on another level. I mean, look how much makeup is on there. I'm gonna probably need four of these or even five. It's so hectic. It's hectic. I'm standing behind that curtain because. It looks better and my room is messy so the background is clean I'm about to rest after I really clean my face hence this is all because I need to take care of the new hair look at that isn't that hectic Another morning, another day at the studios. But to go on set for Rhythm City again, they gave me the same hairstyle. Oh, them nappy edges, child. Yeah, hurry up and wait vibes, but it's fine. I get to hone in on my character who is an AA chairperson. So I'm dealing with drunkards, so I just need to hone in that it's okay. We'll work through it. Don't worry. I'm here for you. Type vibe, you know. <laughs> instead of y'all, you need to just stop drinking instead of that. Because that would be mean. But yeah, it's rainy outside. It's gloomy. My kind of weather. Yes, honey. Yes. This thing is so tight. It's so tight, but it's fine. It's only for the moment. Yeah, guys. I and I have the flu. It's so like my throat is on fire right now. I know it doesn't look like it, but it's on fire, and my nose is blocked. You can probably hear the way I'm speaking. It's just a lot. But we gotta push through, you know. <laughs> we got to push up the room, honey. Yes. Yeah. <coughs> yes. Okay, honey makers, done for the day. 
it's um 10 past 11 in the morning got here at 6 46 or something but yeah i'm actually kind of sad that i'm leaving because it's like that's it that's it and some of them are like oh my gosh you're so lucky you're going home early no no because if i stay longer it means i'm i'm staying you know i'm staying with the work i stay working but you know they're just being ungrateful by the grace of god i will stay for longer next time the whole day because i'm one of the main characters but yeah it's so hard guys and i had to undo this they, they gave me the same hairstyle as i told you earlier and it's just time for it to come off it hurts <sighs> okay see the sweat so much makeup on okay later guys <coughs> bye such a mess <laughs> okay guys i just saw the dumbest thing guy with a new bentley holding his phone with his hand does your new bentley not have bluetooth are you dumb <sighs> hey guys how you doing really <laughs> Sorry, um, I'm using the light from my laptop and I'm using, I'm recording with my phone. Um, so, drama. Uh, today, I just plan to just do some work on my laptop. And then suddenly at, I think it was 10 minutes, uh, what time was it? Somewhere around 1pm, my agent calls me. And she's like, I have an audition for you. They want to see you. You have to be there. The audition is at 2 p.m. Okay? The audition is at 2 p.m. Where? In Johannesburg. I am 45 minutes away from Johannesburg at the... I went to the SABC. 45 minutes away from Johannesburg without traffic. Okay? So... <laughs> Mind you, I was I wasn't I mean I was just working on my on my laptop. I hadn't done my face. I'm, I'm not wearing anything amazing. So I literally just <laughs> stopped whatever I was doing. Sorry about that, it keeps dimming. Um I stopped whatever I was doing. I in my head I'm thinking what to wear. I just pictured my closet in my head, took out items, wore it quickly, put on my face looked at the gps looked no no what did i put on my face looked at the script um the audition script quickly and then drove out and it was raining there was a storm outside thunder lightning and all and that means traffic <laughs> my goodness so um driving and driving and driving and now mind you this is not my car that i'm using and i'm just trying to figure out <laughs> how do i make this the the windscreen not steamy because i uh, the heat is on because it's cold because it's stormy right and i'm just like lord please help me <laughs> lord please there's so much traffic around and um yeah, I'm driving, I'm driving, and driving. I'm using the GPS because I've never been to this specific uh, studio where we were supposed to be auditioning. And then the, D the GPS um, takes me in the area in which the audition is. But then it's not like the exact area. You know when the GPS is like, you have reached your destination. And then you look around and this doesn't look like uh, what the address says. So I parked the car. I come out in my heels mind you i don't wear heels often so i'm already in pain i come out i walk to i was supposed to go to gate five so i see gate four i go to gate four it's like a, a downhill walk so i walk 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 i reach the security box i'm like hello the security box is has the security box has a what is it called is it a one-sided some something where i cannot see inside but the person can see me outside sorry <coughs> <coughs> yeah the flu um so i'm just 
standing out there, like, just staring at this box. Hello, hello, is anybody there? Hello, hello, no answer. So I walk across the parking lot. Mind you, the time is moving, okay? I got, I arrived there at 2.22. The audition is at 2. So I see someone coming out of the building. I go to her. She's probably thinking, who is this beautiful lady running to me? Is she trying to rob me? No, beautiful ladies don't rob. Or do they? Oh, well. So I'm like, please, please, excuse me, ma'am. Sorry to disturb you. I am looking for gate five. And then she's like, oh, you're here for the audition. I'm like, yes. I'm thinking she's going to say the audition is actually here. No, she says gate five is up there, uphill. Still in heels, guys. Still in heels. So she says, oh, no, it's, it's really it's really not far. Just walk up there, you know. Uh, I don't recommend you take your car because there's no parking. So I'm like, okay, fine. Take a deep breath. Lord be with me. And I walk up hell. Okay? It's not a joke. And I get to the security place. Um, the security guy is standing outside. And I tell him where I need to go. Then he says, oh, welcome, beautiful lady. Um, you're very late, but I'm sure they'll take you. So I go inside and they say yes. There's a couple of other people there waiting to be taken up to where the audition the actual audition places so we wait a little and you know we chit chat very nice very nice girl some people when you go to audition and the people there they do so off it's like yes i understand we're all here for the same role but there's no need to be mean about it you know so um yeah go up um and then i go audition this like flirty sexy person <laughs> and they seem to like it they really seem to enjoy it we even had young chats after the audition and then um after auditioning you have to wait to get signed out because the SBC has major security so then we wait while waiting my phone dies <sighs> My phone dies, guys. Mind you, I'm relying on the GPS to take me out of this place because I don't, I don't know how to, <laughs> I don't know how to get out of here. So when I get to the car, I try and plug in uh, where the charger goes, you know, and it doesn't work. It doesn't work. This is three thirty, you know, three thirty. It's the traffic is starting there. That um. <laughs> Uh, after work that that's you know peak time peak time is this is, is coming up and my phone just it that's there's nothing i could do so i sat there <laughs> and then i sat there just asking god to help me because i need this gps to come on so I can get out of here and I can get home, you know. So I sat there for 30 minutes trying to plug this in. Just looking at, because next to me, the, the it's offices. So a lot of people are coming out, you know, getting ready to go home. They're coming out in this, I can see the buildup of traffic. And I'm just like, how am I going to get out of here, Lord? I need this phone to work. And I sat there for 30 minutes, guys, and it just didn't work. It didn't work. So I said, you know what, Lord? I have faith in you. I believe in you. God said, I'll be your GPS. So <laughs> I start the car and I go. <laughs> and I go. Eventually, I found the sign. Eventually, through the traffic. Not because it took me forever to find it. Just... It, eventually because there was a whole lot of traffic i saw the sign that took me to the correct highway and i got home safely wow just wow hey just like that and i had flu and my voice was i didn't have a voice but praise be to jesus as soon as i opened my mouth to audition my voice came out and my nose wasn't as blocked so yeah god is great guys god is good yeah that was my day <laughs>
That was my day. The day in the life of an actress. Okay, guys. Um, I think I'm going to end this year. Because <coughs> I need to take my medication. You know that medication to knock you out is. Yes. That's the one I'm going to take. Okay, love you, honey makers. Thank you for listening to my just random stories and just my rants and stuff. Okay, love you, bye. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and don't forget to share. Love you, honey makers. Mwah!